Well, welcome back to Houston Life. Yes, those are jingle bells you hear. The countdown is absolutely on to the 43rd annual Houston Ballet Nutcracker Market. This annual holiday shopping tradition features everything from apparel to accessories, gourmet foods, treats, home decor, holiday decor, all of it. That's where you find our next guest, the founders of the Holly Ball. That's the inflatable ornament. Christy Moore, Emily Hall, Jennifer Couch are here with me. You guys were amazing on Shark Tank. You got a deal with not one, but two sharks. And tell me, I need the update on the business. Jennifer, you want to go first? So we have been on the road a lot. We've been traveling all over the country to different trade shows, selling like crazy. Um, we've also developed a few new products. We're super excited. We're going to have a couple new colors at, at Nutcracker Market, so be sure to stop by and see us. Okay. And we just launched our mini collection, which is over here. Oh, these they're little eight ones. They're 8-inch. Um, they're good for indoor and outdoor. They're perfect to put um, around your front door, to hang on your indoor tree. So we have been busy creating new product. That's amazing. And you guys were at the last one, and you said it kind of is, was a, a task to keep everything in stock because people see this and they love it. Amberly, talk a little bit about uh, the supply issue, the supply and demand, really, for the Nutcracker Market. Sure, absolutely. So I was behind the scenes most of the time working with getting supply um, you know, filled back in. And so we had several trucks come in during the market that we would have to go and restock certain colors and sizes that people would want. Then we ended up to resorting at one point to a list. Wow. People just wanted it so bad that we would take their name on a list and contact them when we get home, if we had the product or if we were restocked at some point. But um, we've been really excited to offer this product to people. And it, so far, it's, it's been a hit. Well, you guys are a hit. And these are wonderful. These are absolutely a must in any, in any holiday decor. But um, Christy, tell me about what is the most common thing that, or actually I want to say, because people are very humble, right? They want to stay humble. But what is your biggest brag? What are you most proud of with this business? Um, that we're still standing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it has been a whirlwind of the last few years that we started and where we've come from where we just started with a simple concept and just how far we've grown from there. It's been super exciting just to watch us just keep growing. Absolutely. Well, you have the whole community of Houston behind you. What What is, are the sharks still in on it? I mean, you guys still have contact with them. Are you talking to their, their PR people? Because it was Mark and Barbara, right? Uh, yes. Yeah. So yes. Uh, what's, what's the situation with the sh those sharks? So we have great relationships with both of them. We were just in New York. We actually stopped by Barb's wow. office wow. Um, this past weekend. So no, we, we we work with them on, I would say, a weekly basis, and they're they're great to bounce ide ideas off of, give us some direction, some lessons lessons learned the hard way. Um, they're great with advice. I can't say enough good things about both of them. We actually saw Mark on Monday, too. Yes. Yeah. That's wonderful news, because a lot of times I think you say, okay, they say, we're going to you know, back you, and then maybe disappear, because they're so busy, and they are celebrities. So that's wonderful to know. Uh, my next question was, okay, actually, when I got to Houston, the Nutcracker Market, I had never heard of that in my life. And they say, no, no, this is the Super Bowl of holiday decorations of Christmas. Uh, for someone who hasn't been, Amberly, what would you tell them? Why do they need to get into to the Nutcracker Market. It's something that you've never experienced before. You have to go to experience it. There are so many vendors and food, things to buy, shopping. Um, there's so many neat finds that you wouldn't necessarily find every day in just a normal store, so that's kind of fun as well. Um, so I definitely suggest going, and you always can find neat things that, um, like I said, aren't just normally out there for you to. Okay, and just just so everyone's clear, this display here, this is how you inflate the holly ball, right? Correct. Okay, so, and it comes in these huge sizes and it can store back to its original size, which is so amazing. I wanna show you the details for the Houston Ballet Nutcracker Market. It's going on Thursday, November 9th through Sunday, November 12th. Uh, that That's not when it's going on. That's when the tickets get on sale, okay? So NRG Center, you can get it online, ticketmaster.com. If you got a little baby, a little kid, two and under, they're free. Uh, you can't bring strollers, carts, rolling bags, or wagons. But hey, I love the fact that there is a package check and that they will drive you to your car because that is the kind of bougie I'm looking for. <laughs> 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 um, and also 11% of all merchandise uh, will go to various programs like the Houston Ballet that Derek just mentioned with Lauren there. So it's a wonderful cause. Christy, Amberly, Jennifer, thank you so, so much. If you want to learn more about the Nutcracker Market, you can go to nutcrackermarket.com or give them a call, 713-535-3231. Ladies, 
all about the women in business. This is amazing, and we wish you. you continued success, and we know it'll happen for you guys. Thank you, Thank you so, so much. much.